Hey everybody, happy Thursday. Now today's question is all about life coaching and what I think about them. But before I jump into that, are you new to my channel? Welcome, I'm a licensed therapist talking about all things mental health and I release videos on Mondays and on Thursdays. So make sure you're subscribed and have those notifications turned on so that you don't miss out. But let's jump into today's question and it is, Hey Katie, I think an interesting video would be your thoughts on life coaching. I'm seeing this sprout up more and more and I wonder how therapists feel about this trend. Now first, to preface this answer, I want you all to know that I have not worked with a life coach personally. So this is not coming from any personal experience. What I do know of is what my patients have thought about it as well as other friends of mine. And first, I think it's important to know if someone is a real certified life coach or just someone who calls themselves a life coach. Both obviously can help you, but making sure someone is certified can ensure that you are in good hands, or at least it means that they've completed some sort of formal training. And in order to become a real life coach, like a certified life coach, you have to complete a training program. Then you have to get certified. There are many ways to do this, but one path is going through, um, I think it's called like the International Coach Federation, but every state and country may have their own laws and regulations, so it could be different all around the world. Just make sure that you ask, because if someone is certified, what that means is that they have had at least 300 to 500 coaching hours under their belt. So hopefully they know what they're doing, right? Now here's what I think about life coaches overall. They can be very helpful when you kind of just need another perspective or a kick in the pants to get you going and moving towards something. You'd be surprised how helpful it can be to just get some advice and action items from someone who isn't a friend or family member. Where I feel life coaches don't help completely is when we have a real mental health issue that we think could be a mental illness. They are not trained on how to properly diagnose or treat mental illness. And if they're your only resource, I would encourage you to also incorporate a therapist into your treatment team as soon as possible. And as a therapist, I have no problem working with a life coach to ensure you know you're getting all that you need from both of us and we're all on the same page. But between like just needing a kick in the pants, needing some support and advice, to treating a mental illness is really where I draw the line. I do know that some mental health professionals don't like life coaches at all because many don't go through certifications and can hinder their treatment with patients. I've even heard of some going against what their therapist or psychiatrist has said and overall slowing a patient's process. And I personally haven't had this happen, but I have had some really bad life coaches who would flake on my patients or really not do much of anything to support them. But just like any job, there's gonna be people that are really good at their jobs and we love and they really help us grow and change. There's gonna be people that just totally suck. And finally, how I feel about them cropping up more and more and the feeling that this is a trend. I think it's great. If there is ever a trend that encourages people to talk about how they feel and get some sage advice from someone else, I am all for it. I just think it's really important that we make sure they're certified. I know they don't have to be, but that's just my opinion. So we at least have some level of credentials and training. Just like you'd pick out a therapist, you should make sure your life coach listens to you when you talk, is trustworthy, and is on your side rooting for you. You know, ask friends who they've seen. Word of mouth is the best way for recommendations and to ensure you're seeing someone who's worth your time and money. And overall, however you can get help and support, go do it. Trust me, it can only help. But I wanna hear from you. Have you seen a life coach? Did it help you? What's been your experience? Let me know in those comments down below and I will see you next time. Bye.